Okay, so we're explaining um, the use of our canister holder, or our canister stand, uh, and hooking up canisters uh, in, uh, in tandem. So uh, the picture that was sent in was, uh, was uh, piped like this, and the issue that was noted that it actually sucked up through the canister and sucked right into the line, and that's because the uh, tubing was hooked up to the ortho port. We want to make sure that the vacuum line is always the source coming in is always hooked up to the vacuum port and that's because the vacuum port has a mechanical filter on the cardinal version it has a mechanical filter that has to shut off that was being bypassed and that's why it, that's why it uh, it uh, wasn't working as expected now uh, if you're using our our uh, canister stand the one you have probably only has two connections on it um, but that being said, it's, it's hooked up the exact same way. What you're going to do, if you want to hook up canisters in tandem, and I use suction uh, one canister, but have both canisters fill up from one uh, from one suction tubing line, you're going to take your vacuum source, okay? And I'm using another pump, but either way, your vacuum source is going to come in through the top, okay? And this is an on-off lever here, okay? But you want to use, if you're using the Cardinal system, you want to use the system that they've designed. So you're going to want to put the suction into the bottom here, okay? Just like they designed, okay? Um, and then you're going to leave this open because you're now shutting on and turning off right up here, okay? So as you can see, it creates a continuous suction source and it goes into your vacuum line, okay? I've got it off, but your vacuum line comes in here. Now, if you're going to use a tandem system, you then close off the rest of the ports. This is just a collection reservoir. You don't have any uh, patient suction tubing here. What you're going to do is you're going to use this ortho port, okay? And you hook it up from the ortho port uh, on the one to the to the vacuum port. Oh, sorry, to the ortho port on the other, okay? Because you don't need to do a shutoff on this other system, okay? So uh, I don't have two canisters. I'm using our Allied canister, uh, which obviously works the same way. But we have something called a tandem port versus ortho port. Okay, you hook it up the ortho to ortho or tandem to tandem. Okay, at the end of the canister system, i.e., if you're going to do four of them, you go all the way around. If you're uh, only going to use two canisters on one side, like this, and the two canisters on the other, like this one here, you just do it as I'm showing you here. Okay, uh, so you're creating a continuous suction from the source through here up over. When it fills up, because there's no filter on the ortho port, it's going to come through here, okay? And you're going to fill this one up. Obviously, it's coming from the patient. So, you cap off. Make sure you cap off your uh, your um, inlet. If That's made for only if you're using one canister at a time. You cap off everything else except for the patient port. And I'll demonstrate how this works then. We got everything hooked up. Let me grab some. Just demonstrating with water here, but it's the same. What you're going to do is then open your vacuum system. Check to make sure you have vacuum, and you can see it's coming from the patient line, going through here, bypassing the filter because it's got to go into this other canister. It does not bypass this filter. You got to make sure that right before you go to the vacuum source, you're always going through a filter, whether you're using ours or theirs. It comes in and goes into the pump. Okay. But what you'll notice is then we start to fill the um, fill the pumps or fill, sorry fill the canisters and it should only take a minute but uh, you'll notice that once this one fills you'll notice it come up through the tubing here and start to fill this one. and then the the key point here is making sure that you always have a filter before you go to your line so either a filter I, this has an uh, antimicrobial filter, an antibacterial and viral filter. Uh, Cardinals uses a mechanical shutoff, which is effective from stopping the uh, flow of, of liquid. And you'll notice what happens here. Let's see if I can get to the bottom. You'll notice that when it hits the mechanical shutoff, it goes. And it has completely stopped the flow because the canister is full. So that's the proper setup for a tandem system, whether you're using the Cardinal system or the Allied system.